Greetings and salutations fellow 50p collectors. So what have we got in front of us? Well, we've taken a break from the Isle of Man, from the UK. We're now heading over to Gibraltar. And what we have in front of us is uh, my Gibraltar date run of 50p's. Starts up in the left with the 1997 Ring of Dolphins 50p. Makes its way through. You'll see there are variations on the die mark because these have been struck by the Pop Joy Mint. And if we continue on, we can go through. And um, we got not all of them, but we got a large proportion of them. So the first one down there is the Battle of Trafalgar, and then we have the Capture of Gibraltar, and then the Capture of Gibraltar, Capture of Gibraltar, and so on and so forth. We get on to Our Lady of Europe, and then we go on to Capture of Gibraltar again, and we work our way through. We've got Capture of Gibraltar, Gibraltar. You can see a sort of theme with these coins, can't you? Some of these coins, if you get one that's in nice condition, the detail on them is really, really nice. You may have to look at it under under magnification, but the detail is really, really nice on those coins. Uh, we go on to the Barbary Ape, which was released for a couple of years. And then we have the anniversary of the referendum 50p with the royal crest on it. And... We have the second one because there's two die marks, so die mark A, A and A, B, or is that B, A? That might actually be a B, A one. Yep, that's a B, A die mark. And we carry that on. We've got, uh, what's that, New Calpy House, Norfolk Square. We've got the ceiling one. Uh, we've got the Skywalk 50p. And... The Skywalk 50p to me always looked a little bit blurry, but if you do zoom in on it, it does have quite a nice bit of detail to it. I would have to say, though, you wouldn't have a chance of getting me under that, not at all. Not only can I not go on boats without getting sick, I suffer from vertigo. I only need to go up three steps in a ladder and I start to feel wobbly. And then the next two we have, we have a couple of spaces. So we have the 2020 uh, Pandemic Error Coin. And we have the standard 2020 pandemic coin. And then we have Catherine and William. And we have the Queen's 95th uh, birthday. So that is the complete run of Gibraltar coins, excluding the Gibraltar Christmas coins, which I also collect. But the coin we have to add in tonight is a pandemic coin. So if we have a little look at this one, it's rather nice as well. And nice bit of detail on it. Have a little look at that. And we unite as one 2020. So you got the doctors and and that on the front of it, all with their with their face masks on there and their goggles and all that. And yeah. So well, you know, you probably know what I think of the pandemic, so I'm not going to say anything further on that. But if we turn the coin over, what did interest me with this coin is Again, we don't have the Queen's head on this coin, but we have the coat of arms. So the previous coin we looked at that has the coat of arms, which is got the Queen's head on the other side, the, the standard Pop Joy effigy of the Queen. If we turn that one over and just compare the two of them, at first glance, these two coins would look very similar. Uh, the crest in the middle is the same, but the script around the outside is different. So they both say 50 pence at the bottom. And this one says 50th anniversary of the referendum. And then this one in script says Elizabeth II, DG Regina, Gibraltar 2020. So the first look at these coins are very, very similar. And then if you turn them over, this one is what you would expect to see. You have the, the Queen's head. And when we turn this one over, then we have the pandemic. So really, I think they'll probably go like that if we're looking at the obverses of them. So... This coin doesn't have the Queen's head as such, but it does have the Royal Coat of Arms. So quite interesting in itself. But uh, this coin that I purchased today is the non-error coin. So this one we need to pop a little bit of cardboard in that. And we can pop the COVID-19 coin in there. So that's the pandemic coin. And that's the latest one to join the collection. And... Over time, this collection will hopefully fill up the tray. It probably won't take much longer. <laughs> They've released quite a few coins. So looking forward to getting more coins. And again, more importantly, looking forward at some point, and I don't know when, I can't find it, 
is the 1998 AA Ring of Dolphins 50P and the 2001 AA Dolphins Ring of uh, Ring of Dolphins 50P. Uh, we do have the AB 2001, but I just need to track down this AA one. It seems to be quite elusive. So that's it for now. A little trip over to, to Gibraltar to wind up with today's coin hole. The last few couple, the last couple of days have been uh, quite mental. Had quite a few coins to come through. They were you, you seem to order these coins and then they all come over two days. Uh, so the good news is there's still a few more coins to arrive and when they do arrive we'll get the video up on those and share it with all you fellow 50p collectors. So good luck with your 50p hunting and peace and love, Coin Snatcher out.